Hello, press on, and welcome to your Monday, July 6th Stronger Together workout. For today's workout, we have three five minute AMRAPs. Your first five minute AMRAP will be alternating dumbbell snatches, then you will have a two minute rest. Your second five minute AMRAP will be 100 meter runs, then you will have a two minute rest, and your third five minute AMRAP will be dumbbell walking lunges. For your warm today, we are going to start with 30 seconds of ankle mobility. So you're gonna come down into a squat. You can hold on to the top of your feet if you'd like. You're gonna to try to keep your heels on the ground while you shift your weight from side to side, trying to drive your knee over your toes. So we'll do this for 30 seconds. Once you're done with your ankle mobility, you will go for a 200 meter run. When you come back in, you'll do 10 long lunges. So when you lunge, guys, you wanna make sure you're stepping nice and wide, nice big step here. That back foot, uh, sorry, that back knee is kissing the ground. You're gonna drive up through that front foot. Nice wide step. <laughs> After your long lunges, you will do 10 PVC pass-throughs. So you can start with your hands nice and wide, locking out your arms, getting that PVC pipe behind you. That's too easy. Move your hands a little bit closer. Find that sticky spot between your shoulders. You're getting a nice shoulder stretch. We are going to do two rounds of all those movements. Next, we are going to warm up for power snatches for your first um, five minute AMRAP for today. Um, so we're gonna start in a hang position here. So we're sending your hips back, chest is nice and high, and from here we are just going to squeeze our butt and shrug. And keeping your arm nice and straight, that dumbbell is gonna float up. All right, so it's back and shrug. Next, we're going to add a high pull. So from here in that hang position, as we are squeezing our butt and shrugging, we're also driving that elbow up. Think about starting along, all right? Elbow straight up. Next, we're gonna go into a hang muscle snatch. So that looks like this, hips back, and then you're punching the ceiling. You are not doing a second dip here, guys. So again, hips back, and then punching the ceiling. If you do a second land, I will see, and I will make you do burpees. Next, we're going to do a hang power snatch. So from here now, we're landing underneath that dumbbell. So it looks like this, punching the ceiling, and landing in that Core of a squat. So again, and last, we're gonna put everything together and we're gonna do the power snatch from the ground. So with one dumbbell, you'll put your dumbbell between your feet. So from here, you want your hips lower than a deadlift here. And as you come up, you guys are gonna deadlift it up, squeezing your butt, and then punching your dumbbell overhead. Make sure you guys stand up all the way before you lower your dumbbell. And remember, for the workout, you are doing alternating dumbbell snatches. We're gonna do two rounds of this warm-up. In the first round, you will do five reps on each side. Then if you'd like to grab a heavier dumbbell, you're gonna do three reps on each side for the second round of the warm-up. As a reminder, your workout for today is three five-minute AMRAPs, starting with alternating dumbbell snatches. Then you will have a two-minute rest. Then you're going into 100 meter runs, two minute rest, and then your last five minute AMRAP is dumbbell walking lunges. For all three of these um, workouts today, you should think about just staying consistent with your reps, um, trying not to take long breaks, just keep moving throughout the workout. So your weight for your snatches and your dumbbell should not be crazy heavy where you have to break after five reps. Um, if you cannot do power snatches from the ground or if you are struggling, with your mechanics, you will just do a regular hang power snatch like we went through um, in the beginning of the warm up. So, just from a hang position versus going all the way to the ground. If you have an issue with running, you can do mountain climbers, you can do jump ropes, you can do jumping jacks. Again, whatever is going to keep you consistent for the whole workout. And same thing with the lunges, just keep moving the whole time. For your cool down today, we're going to do three rounds of eight Bulgarian split squats per side and then a 30 second star plank on each arm. So for the Bulgarian split squats, you're going to find something to elevate your back foot. It does not have to be crazy high if you don't feel comfortable. From here, you're gonna hold dumbbells at your side and you're going to drive that back knee as close to the ground as you can and come back up. You wanna take a three second lowering phase, so you're going to go even slower than what I just demonstrated. So three, two, one, come back up. Make sure you guys are also looking forward and you are not looking down and compromising your back. So again, 
three, two, one, and stand. If you don't feel comfortable doing it with the weight, no problem, drop your weight and do these unweighted. Again, three, two, one, and stand. Next, we're going to do 30 seconds star plank on each side. So I'm gonna show you what it looks like real quick and then I'll explain how you get there. So star plank. The easiest way to get up there is come up into that high arm side plank first, lift your arm and then just slowly lift that leg up and get that balance, keeping your core nice and tight, making sure you're extra stable. You'll do 30 seconds on each side. If you can't do a star plank, don't worry, we have a modification for you. You're not gonna get off that easy. So from here, you can do a regular side plank from your forearm, just getting your hips off the ground and put your hand on your hip to force your chest up so you're not letting your shoulders come forward and you're still activating your core. You can also come up to make it a little bit more challenging on the palm of your hand. That is your Stronger Together workout for today. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. I'll see you guys soon.